poor, simple fools. You think you can defeat me? Me, the mistress of all evil! Yes. I can, and I will. What's going on, God Zero Nation? This is our God Zero. Welcome back to another installment of our God Zero's Retro Rewind. But more importantly, welcome back to another episode from our Kingdom Hearts adventure. We're just picking up some emblem pieces in order to get this goddamn door open. I think I've got them all. Maybe missing one. I think that's all of them. Please let it be all of them. Thank God. Don't mind me hitting the pause button. I got a little bit excited and started clicking things. Why? It was mine. Know this. The heart that is strong and true shall win the Keyblade. What? You're saying my heart's weaker than his? For That's that exactly what he's saying. Was. However, you can become stronger. You showed no fear in stepping through the door to darkness. It held no terror for you. Plunge deeper into the darkness, and your heart will grow even stronger. What should I do? It's really quite simple. Don't listen to him, it's that simple. Open yourself to the darkness. That is all. Let your heart, your being, become darkness itself. He's on the cusp of being past Redemption at this point in time. Anybody can get on the path to forgiveness, but uh, Riku's well and truly gone off the deep end. At least I've got my Keyblade back and we can actually get some damage done while we fight. And if you're wondering why, uh... We still have Donald in our team when we could do the other option of having Beast in our team... That'd be because Donald came through pretty clutch in the previous episode. Probably would think I'm lying if I told you, but, um... He wasn't just healing, but he made sure we made it through that battle alive. He, um, he did his job for the first time in the entire playthrough. Don't ask me where I'm going. I have absolutely no idea. Hollow Bastion is an absolute maze. And you need to be prepared to, uh... To get a little bit lost in order to go forward. Donald, where was the hills that time, you duck fuck? A few moments later... That flying bastard was doing my head in. gonna glide over the top. Thank you Peter Pan for teaching a man how to glide. Saving myself a lot of drama. S 
So, I see the path has emerged at last. Yes. The keyhole to the darkness. Unlock it. And the Heartless will overrun this world. What do I care? The darkness holds no power over me. Rather, I will use its power to rule all worlds. Such confidence. Oh, someone's got a keyblade of his own now. Ah, Mr. Darkness. Impossible. The princesses of heart are all here. It must be her. Without her heart, she will never be able to release her power. The king's fools are here. I'll deal with them myself. You stay here and guard the princesses. I mean, Maleficent can try to take me on. She'll soon find out why I'm the chosen one. Here! Donald! Let's just make sure everybody's got uh, a little bit of MP up their sleeve for this incoming battle. It's called strategy, people. I'm afraid you're too late. Any moment now, the final keyhole will be unsealed. This world will be plunged into darkness. It is unstoppable. We'll stop it. After coming this far, there's no way we're gonna let that happen. You poor, simple fools. You think you can defeat me? Me, the mistress of all evil! Yes. I can, and I will. That's right, we have to... Can we attack her directly or do I have to hurt her rock? Thank you, Donald. We can attack her directly. It's just a matter of if we attack the rock, we temporarily take down what she's using to hold herself up. And now at least Donald and Goofy can get involved as well. Come on, boys. Get in on the action. Unleash my fury, bitch. Thank you, Donald. See, Donald coming in the clutch again. He's proving himself. I had my doubts. But, uh, our last couple of outings, Donald's really stood strong. Goofy just went up a level. Let's give Donald some health. And the Goof Man. Donald again! Give ourselves that arrow. She's 
turned into a magical green ball again. Take it down, boys. Thank you, D-Man. Let's go. Home stretch, gentlemen, let's do this. Stand under here and keep on doing some magic damage. Danny, bitch, I'll give you what's what. Sorry if I'm going quiet, I'm trying to focus. Because there's so much going on when you take on Maleficent in this battle. You've got to be prepared to be flung off of the podium. You've got the other enemies below you that are wanting a piece. Maleficent herself is trying to get a piece. Sora just gained a level. Come on, boys, put in the work. Ray's podium definitely takes her ability to have a little bit more survivability to a whole new level. Come 
on your magic green ball of shit. <laughs> Got him! See? I told you it was a viable strat to drop that thunderbolt from underneath. But you weren't listening to me, goddammit. And Maleficent has faded away. We learned Chia, or Donald learned Chia. We obtained some of more of Ansem's reports. Beautiful, there's some place for us to save. Now we can change some of these around. But no AP left. Um, we definitely want to up that. Let's see what some of these can do and whether we can take some of them off. Well, well, well. Give us a little bit of a cheeky save. Don't mind if I do. Ignore the 17 hour countdown as well. I haven't played 17 hours. I just pause the game sometimes and then walk away from the console and the time keeps on ticking. Wrong, Maleficent. Bit lighthearted. Some help. Riku. Is that? Yes, a keyblade. Not as good Unlike as mine. Yours. This keyblade holds the power to unlock people's hearts. Allow me to demonstrate. Behold! No. Now, open your heart. Surrender it to the darkness. Become darkness itself! This is it. This power! <laughs> darkness. The true darkness! Anybody who knows Maleficent knows exactly what she's about to turn into. She is a dragon. Speaking of dragon, I'll be dragging these nuts in a minute. But first things first, we're going to take this bitch out of the equation. We need to make sure Maleficent is done for good. And she has a nasty arsenal up her sleeve. She's got that tail whip. Her fire breathing ability is incredibly strong. But what is really going to help us is our gliding ability. As I mentioned before, gaining the gliding ability from Peter Pan in Neverland is one of the most clutch abilities we will have in our entire build. Thank you, Donald. Wind. 
Genie. I was thinking about who we bring out here. Maybe Genie can help us out. The summons have been really hit and miss. For some reason, I thought the summons were a lot stronger, but there's been some situations where they have proven absolutely useless. Alright, Genie. See, just like he's hitting Maleficent now. Almost a waste. Almost a waste. I reckon if we were just to hack and slash with the Keyblade, we would have done more damage by now. I don't get it. Summon should be a lot stronger than that. So I'm just going to go to town with my Keyblade. We're getting out of this alive today, gentlemen. Those green flames are torture. We're having to work overtime with curing ourselves here because, uh... Donald in the blink of an eye seems to have gone back to his old ways. Thank you, Donald. He worried about saving me before he saved himself. This would have to be probably one of my favorite boss battles. Purely because Maleficent as a dragon is so iconic to Disney as a whole. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys have a favourite Disney, like, villain, or if you've played the Kingdom Hearts games, if you've got a favourite Disney villain boss pertaining to the Kingdom Hearts franchise. I think I've already made it abundantly clear to you guys at home that, uh, we're going to get Bambi out here, but I've made it clear that Oogie Boogie's my favourite villain from, uh, Kingdom Hearts. Hades from Hercules is one of my favourite villains. Captain Hook is up there as well. Hey Bambi. Bambi's going to give us all of these MP bubbles, which is going to help us get some heals. Hopefully get some arrow going as well. Oh Jesus. Not gonna lie, Bambi's not the most, well, at least I thought wasn't the most useful summon, but being able to get all of those extra MP points, very handy. I think I appreciate the summons now more so than I did the first time I played the game. Like Tinkerbell, I completely forgot she actively heals. Bambi helping us out with the MP bubbles I always thought was a waste, but now in the grand scheme of things, definitely is not the case. Come on, guys. Got her down to almost half health. Let's go, let's go. Donald's gone and got himself killed. I don't know why I do this, Donald. 
There we go. He got the heals for Goof. That's what I was hoping he would do. Gliding is so clutch against the dragon. It is not funny. Ow. Thank you, Donald. We're gonna go overtime here, come on. Need to get away from those green flames. Let's go. Game, set, and match, bitch! That's what I'm talking about. All of a sudden, Maleficent Stranglehold has ceased to exist. How ironic. She was just another puppet after all. What? The Heartless were using Maleficent from the beginning. She failed to notice the darkness in her heart eating away at her. A fitting end for such a fool. Well. Obtain fire glow, that's a thing. 